Hello everyone, welcome back for new tutorial. In this tutorial, we are going to make a walk cycle animation in After Effects. Before watching this tutorial, make sure you have installed Duik Basil plugin in your After Effects. And please subscribe the channel and like the video because we are posting video tutorials regularly in our channel. Alright, let's get started. First of all, as you see, I have this vector file and in this uh, file, as you see, characters, body parts are in separate layers. As you see, this is body, this is foot one, calf one and tie one. And be careful when you draw your character, make sure you have this circle at top. And again, for calf layer, make sure you have this circle as well, because that will not yield any problems for us okay let's see other parts as you see this is head this is hand one forearm and arm one as you see and lastly this is tools okay let's jump into the after effects and let's do animation all right here we are in after effects as you see i have imported my files this is worker vector file as you see i click on it and open it the first thing we are going to do, come to the window and open the Basel plugin. Choose rigging and come to the create structures. We will create structures, which is homonoid. Homonoid includes arm, leg, spine, tail. So let's click on it. The structures are created, as you see. Perfect, the structures are ready for use. So let's start with arm. I choose here arm one for arm, hand and arm tip. As you those structures, I put them in front of the arm one here. Okay, so let's choose this vector layers and press T, decrease the opacity because we will put these structures onto the our layer i choose these structures and put them here okay let's zoom so that we can arrange and locate them in a pro in a proper location here choose and drag here here again choose forearm as you see this is our circle which we will bend it so i choose this circle and put it center of the circle excellent again come this layer and choose this hand and put the center of the circle good lastly this one this is arm tip good okay now we can Now we need to choose those layers again, increase the opacity and make 100. Okay, now we should parent these uh, layers with structures. So come to the arm one and choose structure arm. Again, forearm, structure, forearm, hand one with structure hand. Excellent. Now let's do the same thing for the other hand. All right, let's uh, put the structure for the leg, for the legs, and then rig them. So I come here, choose tie, calf, foot, toes, tiptoe, and heel, and put them on the first leg excellent again choose all of them bring bring them okay now we need to put them in proper locations so just choose tie put it here 
But first we need to choose leg layers and press T decrease the size so can we can see the anchor points okay and come choose calf put it here good choose foot put this location excellent and choose toe put them here this is tip toe we need to locate it here this is heel and we need to move to the heel excellent good now let's choose again layers and make them 100 opacity good let's do same thing for the other leg All right, the last thing we need to do for the body, so I choose hips and spine to those layers and bring them over the body layer here and we need to put them for put them in proper locations. So I zoom in and put them here again we need we don't need to change these locations but we should choose neck layer neck structures and put this here lastly this is head and i need to put here lastly spine too that's good okay let's zoom this this was the our first process we have created structures and put them on the layers so the second process will be parent with the structures all right come to the arm two and parent with structure arm two forearm forearm two hand two with hand two structures good we have parented layers with structures for the first hand and we need to come to the tie tie to tie to calf calf to and foot to with foot to excellent come to the for the first leg tie one with tie calf one with calf and foot one with foot we have parented with them lastly we need to parent head with body good and body should be parented with hips now we need to combine those layers with the body so i choose arm 2 and bring it here for the proper position good and arm 1 excellent uh, let's go to the legs so this is second leg back leg i mean and put it here and this is first leg we will locate tools here but we can change its location as well we will do later on now as you see we need to put arm layers this arm layers below the body layer so that we can see them on the back side good and again choose leg two layers and put them below the body layer as you see that's good location lastly choose tools and put them under the 
and one layer so that we can see it back side of the layer all right the third phase will be rigging so we need to choose all of the structure layers okay choose all of them good come to the doig basil plugin here come to the rigging click and constraints and click on auto rig and ik it will be rigged we need to wait a little bit time it depends on your computer Rigging has been done as you see let's see our layers so now we have controller layers as you see those are our controller layers so let's see each of them I choose hand one sorry hand two and let's see how the rigging has been done excellent but as you see the elbow is not in a correct position so come to do here firstly come this effect and controls and enable reverse good it is in a correct position okay control Z and control Z again now I choose hand 2 again and make reverse choose hand 1 let's see this layer we need to reverse it again so make reverse foot 2 as you see we need to reverse it as well so come here and reverse make reverse unchecked foot one foot one is in a good position okay good now as you see it doesn't fit to my composition so I choose I choose all of the layers and excellent now the last thing we need to do make a walk cycle so come to the those controller layers select all of them and come here automations in this section we will see walk cycle parameter so when I click on it it will automatically generate a walk cycle excellent as you see it has been generated let's make a preview so that we can understand if we did in a correct way perfect we have did a great job excellent now as you see the last thing I need to do choose this tools and make it and put it in a proper location here under the hand and I need to parent with hand one let's see again as you see the tools are moving with body perfect all right guys now i want to show you some parameters for the walk cycle come to the walk cycle this is controller as well uh, come this uh, main parameter character as you see there are some uh, parameter weight energy softness you can increase and decrease them come to the walk cycle if you want to increase the walk cycle so i choose minus five let's see the character will move a little bit fast all right that was the conclusion of this tutorial guys uh, for the next tutorial we will put this character on a scene so that we can see the character moves from the left position to the right position and when he reached the right position he will stop walking all right if you like this tutorial please like the video and do not forget to subscribe my youtube channel See you next tutorial.